So going through this process of my surgery that I had done and being non-weight bearing, there are certain things that I've definitely learned. And uh, one of the interesting things I've learned happened yesterday. I was on my way to my youth group where I teach in the youth group at First Baptist Church. And I've been teaching there for 20 plus years and have been to the Jefferson building where we have Wednesday night services a thousand times or more over the years. And my son Corbett was driving me up there because I can't drive and I'm on a scooter. And as I was driving up there, I was thinking in my mind, is there a handicap ramp to get into the building or not? Now think about this. I've been in that building thousands of times over the last 20 plus years. And I could not tell you if there was a handicap ramp or not. After all those times I've gone into that door, I've walked into that door, couldn't tell you. In my mind, I could not visualize it because I never needed to know. I never needed to know until last night. And so when we came around the corner at 8th and Boston and pulled up and I looked, for the first time I saw, it's a ramp. There's no steps. But I couldn't have told you that before because I never took the time to look at it, to realize it because I didn't need to know, but now I needed to know. And it made me realize I go around every day not realizing what people go through that have a disability, whether that be because they're non-weight bearing or they can't walk or they've had an amputation or whatever it is. I never notice, is there a handicap ramp? Is there a place they can get in? I never notice when I go into a bathroom, is there a rail? But now I need to know. And now I notice, and it's changed the way I look at things because I see it from a whole different perspective. My disability will go away. This will heal. I'll be fine. I'll be back up on my feet, but I'll never change the way I see things. And that has been a blessing in this process to allow me to see things that I haven't seen before. So as you go about your day, be mindful of what other people go through. I thought I was, but I wasn't, not in every aspect. But to make the most of every opportunity, you've got to be mindful of everything, of things people are going through mentally, physically, emotionally, because it makes a difference. And we can make a difference when we notice. So make the most of every opportunity and don't miss the little things. Moeo, everywhere we go.